So, Bill, out. it's your first game back today for the Borough for pre-season. But before we touch on that, let's go back to probably, what, a season and a half ago yeah. now when you first joined the club yeah. and you got your injury. Uh, just talk us through your rehab and, you know, what was going through your mind while you weren't playing football. Um, to be honest, I'm always, I've always been kind of mentally strong. Uh, unfortunately, that did happen on the first game for the Borough. Uh, I did do my ACL. Uh, but to be honest, it's one of the things that if you let it keep you down, it will affect you. But I just seen it as a positive thing. I worked hard and I'm, I feel like I'm back stronger than ever kind of thing. Yeah, so did you have other things to sort of focus on to keep, to keep yeah, your yeah, mind active? Yeah, I'm, I'm a very family orientated man. Uh, the cake business, of course, as you know, you have a good successful cake business. So it kept me busy. It kept me busy enough as well as me working hard on my rehabilitation myself. So yeah, so it's not that bad. Yeah, so of course you you did re-sign sort of towards the end of last season as well, but we were yet to see. Was that yeah. kind of you were sort of on the edge of coming back? And uh, then... Yeah, so it was just a little bit of formalities. I was meant to come back, and then certain things happened with the family side of it. I couldn't really make it. It was a bit difficult. Okay, so yeah, so you've played uh, forty-five minutes today. Yeah, give about or 35, take. Yeah, yeah 35. thirty-five. What was it like being back feels out there good, on the man. pitch? Feels good. Feels sharp. I still know that. Um, my, my, my strengths have always been driving with the ball, uh, linking up the, the strikers and the forward people. I felt like people got to see a little bit of that today, of course. I'm just still a little bit leggy, of course. Not really played a game in 18 months kind of thing. So that was my first game in a competitive situation. So it's looking good. Uh, I know that I've just got to get fit and then uh, we'll see where it goes from there. Now, I would say, what was it like being back around the lads? But of course, you could kind of only really saw them for a little bit yeah, before yeah, your injury. Yeah. And then there's some new boys, you know, you've got yeah. the likes of Steno and things yeah. that are here. So how, how do you see coming back, the uh, the new lads linking in with the... Definitely, we've got a great bunch of lads in there. It's, it's full of everything, isn't it? You've got a bit of experience, fresh blood, quality. It's, you've got the right bunch together, the right bundle together this year. Uh, and I definitely think it will be a title winning year. Do you think the calibre of the opposition tonight was the perfect test um, going into the new season with the ambition the club has and the aim to get back up into the National League North? Definitely. If you, if you look... Don't get me wrong, they did control a lot part of the game with the ball, but the lads together, their shape was sound, it was tight. Everything I've been working on in pre-season with Andy, absolute attention to detail with that man. And you'll, you'll definitely see in the season when we come against hit with players and, and teams of our level, that will we'll definitely walk all over them, hopefully. Um, I think the scoreline didn't really reflect the game, really. It was three moments of magic and quality, really, from Notts County. Um, how do you think the lads responded to the challenge um, facing up against top players like David McGoldrick and um, Macaulay Longstaff? I think it's, it's one of the things, isn't it? As a player, you don't really look at your position until after the game. Uh, don't get me wrong, they've been around the likes of Dan Crowley. Uh, these big names, they have been at high clubs, but it's one of the things as a football player, you just get on there and it's, it's my shirt against his shirt at the end of the day, as long as I can do a job on him. There will be times where he has the better of it because he's just... His ability will shine through, but the, the, the given has to be the hard work, and the lads put that in today. It was just, like you said, three moments that we switched off, and that's where the quality comes through. Yeah, so of course, uh, this will be your first full season with the Borough. Have you set yourself any aims for something? Do you like to chip in with goals? Yeah, yeah or? definitely. It's a minimum 15 goals. It has to be a minimum this season of 15 goals. Another 15 assists have to be involved in that, the fun side of it, and just. I'm one of them people that like to drag our players through when things are getting tough. Whether that be running hard, tackling hard, winning headers, scoring goals, they all count. Well, Bilal, it's great to see it as a positive environment uh, after the heartbreak of the playoff final yeah. last season. So we wish you all the best for the rest of the pre-season and the season ahead. Appreciate it, mate. Take care.